Working for the choke here, trying to get that arm underneath the back of the neck. It looks like he's got that north-south choke locked in. He might get it here, look at this. And here's another clean shot that lands. And here's another clean shot that lands. Huge left, left, left hand. hand there. to see this talented fighter make the walk again once tonight. Gotta think he'll look to use his speed and footwork in this fight. Those appear to be his biggest advantages. Maybe not the most powerful guy on the roster necessarily, but exceptionally quick on the feet. Very good at using his feet to set up angles for his offense and will mix it up. A lot of variations to his attacks. Can fight on the outside, but also not afraid to enter the pocket to stick and move. Great job of moving that head off the center line. Just an outstanding striker who brings a lot of different attributes to the table. This fighter has outstanding footwork. He is amongst the best in the world at changing angles and always being in a position where he can land against his opponent, but he's out of range of his opponent's counterattacks. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Two years apart, these two fighters with big differences in height and reach. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, a referee in charge of the Octagon, Eve Lavigne. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the O2 Arena in London, England. <laughs> Only professional record of 14 wins, one loss. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Fort Lauderdale, Florida, USA, Kobe Chaos, Kobe Chaos. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the left corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 6 feet 6 inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Body out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Iceman. Okay, protect yourself at all time will be my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. They touch him up and we are underway. You ready? You ready? All right, so this UFC Grand Prix tournament is coming up next. This format has been all the rage with a lot of the hardcore mixed martial arts fans out there. Sort of an homage to the history of UFC and Pride with a single night tournament game event here. And let's see who can be the last man standing here tonight. Caught him with a punch. Oh, there's a good shot from the bottom. Excellent movement here on the ground. Transitions back to full guard. Oh, looked like an elbow there from the top. I love it. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. He's moved into half guard again. Nice punch to the body. Oh, Vicious elbow. elbow lands to the head. Moves back to full guard now. Oh, pretty good work here from the bottom, Joe, as he tags him with that punch. He postures into place. Oh, 
Joe doing a nice job here, staying busy from the bottom. He's softening him up with elbows. Midway through round one. Oh, he's got the ground and pound going now. off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Just over two minutes to go in the round. Posture's up here. Oh, really nice work to keep busy off of his back as he lands some more offense here from bottom. Working for the choke here, trying to get that arm underneath the back of the neck. It looks like he's got that north-south choke locked in. He might get it here. Look at this. as he looks to improve position here. Tries to pass from full guard to half guard, but can't. Beautiful reverse. Covington gets the takedown. Useful. Oh, lands that punch. He moves into half guard. Oh, exactly as he threw it up. Postures up. Lands a flush, clean elbow. Big shot from the bottom. Look at the pass. Excellent sweep. Back to full guard. Guillotine yeah. attempt. That horn sounds means we have reached the end of round one. Good. And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Incredible highlights in that round. Brittany Palmer in the building as usual. Now, this is nasty. Yet again, they will clinch here. Big punch from the bottom. Oh, now he's got double underhooks here. Oh, nice work from the bottom. Tags him with the punch. Battle for position here. Now goes to the uppercut. about it, so he lands another takedown. They're starting to really pile up here, and his opponent can't see the entry. So, heady stuff here with the takedowns. We'll see if he can execute here now on the ground. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Into side control again. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Right back into full guard. Hammer fist blocked. Under two minutes now to go round two. He's back into side control here. He's looking to work that mounted crucifix. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Looking for the north-south choke. And he's out. He's got to move. He's in the Mount of Crucifix now. Nice.
excellent movement and transitions here on the ground, staying busy. He's gonna try to take the back, I think. Lands a strike there. Excellent movement here on the ground. That's a big shot right there. He's now working from side control again. Now he's got the mounted crucifix. 20 seconds to go round two. Oh, strong punch there by Covington. And he moves into the mount. He lands a huge elbow to the head. Big Beautiful body, body shot. shot there too. What a round. Hey, stop. Let's take a look at some of the action from that round. Here's a big punch that results in a knockdown. Let's take a look at that again. Let's see it one more time. Catch your breath, breathe, listen. You can do this now. I want you to go down and put your combinations on. Thank you very much, Carly Baker. try to pick up where he left off. Well, you didn't see a lot of the body work from him in the earlier rounds, but he's certainly getting after it here. Big shot to the body connects there. We'll see if he can follow it up. Oh, slam! Now he's in half guard. Now, now he's on top in half guard. Covington's lower jaw now, Joe, starting to show some signs of swelling. He's mounted him. Complete That'll do it. domination! TKO victory. He was not intelligently defending himself, and that's a wrap. Yeah, I wouldn't mind seeing that again. Exciting flurry at the end of this fight. It was the one big strike that started it all, dropped the opponent, led to that knockdown, and ultimately created the opening to jump in and force the stoppage. Referee made the right call stepping in here. And here's where the ref called it. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the victory by TKO. Huge result inside the Octagon tonight. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has gone stop to this contest at one minute, 12 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by TKO, Kobe Chaos Covington. So there he is, the man of the moment after the TKO victory here tonight. He had some doubters coming in here. A lot of people wondering if he...